Well, it looks like we are going back to do for town. So, we can wrap this episode up here. Get this item. Fuck. <laughs> What's up, everybody, and welcome to part four of the Snakewood Let's Play, and it's... Uh, I've just had a problem with my recording equipment, so unfortunately, I've picked up this magic harp um, without... I'll tell you what, just make sure it doesn't happen again. I'm going to quickly save the state. I picked up this magic harp, and I did it off-cam because it wasn't record... Well, it did record, and then it stopped for some reason. So, there we go. Never mind. But we got the magic harp off of this dead guy here. That we were going to get in the first place. Uh, and it's got an item. Which is the HMO3. Which is what we thought it was going to be. Thought that's what... Well, that was the idea we had. That we might get surf from it. So let's see if anyone can learn it. No. However, I'm guessing because they've given us that Magikarp. The idea is that Magikarp will be able to learn surf. When it's a Gyarados. Now, I'm just looking at the rest of my team. Nobody here is going to evolve into anything that learns Surf. That's my problem here. Apart from maybe Ectoplasm, but I don't know about that. Uh, which also makes me think about what I've got in the PC. Uh, I think it's only Skitty. What else have I got? Skitty and... Uh, Taylo. That's right. So let's just put Magikarp away for a sec. Um, now, Taylor won't be able to, so it's just... I don't think Skitty will either, but... I'm just I'm just going on the off chance that it might, no. Okay. That's cool. So we'll put Skitty back away then. Uh, and we will... Idiot. See, now I don't... Uh, <coughs> oh, excuse me. I don't know whether to... Rock out with... Taylor... Because I've already got that egg um, that's like a useless Pokemon. Or whether I carry Magikarp around with me and try and train them both up. Because that guy's going to be a Gyarados eventually. <sighs> right. We're going to go with that. Taylor's always in the bank if I change my mind. So not a problem now. We need to work out how we're going to get something that can learn Surf. Um... And my first thought right now is Wingle, uh, which is on Route 3, I believe, or Route 2, you can get those. So we're going to go backwards. I don't know if I need to heal or not, but let's just do that just in case. And we're going to go... What route's this? Route 102, yeah, so I think it's 103 is the one north of here. Uh, I know there's Wingles here, so let's just uh, keep... Let's just find one. Now will be the time that I do not find one. Zigzagoon. Honestly, I've ran into a Wingle every time I've come on this route. Right, okay. Dude, they know. They know that I need a Wingle right now. And they're just taking the piss out of me. However, it's a little bit of uh, grind training for my uh, Pisha. Pishacha. I'm looking for a wingle. Never gonna fucking find one. Never gonna fucking find a wingle. Oh, fuck right off. What is this? What is happening? They literally can't normally walk a step for running into a fucking wingle in this route. Wingle. Ooh. I am just a man. If I can't surf again this time tomorrow. Hey, it's my boy. It was the singing that made it happen. Uh, so. Great ball. Uh, yes. Oh, there's no way that thing doesn't stay in a great ball. That's absolutely ridiculous. Um, kill it. 
<laughs> I don't want that one if it's going to play games with me. I'd rather grind and get the next one. Oh, I've got, mm, I've got a, uh, I've got an egg with leech life. Could send that out against it to try and weaken it down if I get another one. When I get another one, I'm pretty sure this is the only surfing. Oh, mind you, what about Surskit? Is there a Surskit on Route Two? Hmm. Dude, I'm asking questions of my life right now. Why am I only running into one Wingle? Like, how many times have I got to go into this grass? I'm going to uh, lose my shit. Maybe the next one I won't just kill it when it pops out of one Pokeball because I'm angry at it. Maybe I'll be a bit more patient with it. Maybe that'd be sensible. Sensible is my middle, first and last name. That's right, I'm sensible, sensible, sensible. We're grinding. Grinding. There's not a wingle in this scratch that I can find. If we're grinding, then we're really bored. Fucking really bored. Why did I just catch a zigzagoon? Why did I even do that? <laughs> well, that's okay. We're going to call him a uh, very spooky name. Uh, we're going to call him Terry. Spooky Terry! Yay, Wingo! Yay! Okay. This is the one. And while we're trying to catch it, let's find a good name for a spooky bird. Got one already. Don't even need to look. Don't even need to look. Wingle has the habit of carrying prey and valuables in its beak and hiding them in all sorts of locations. This Pokemon rides the winds and flies as if it was skating across the sky. Now, hopefully, it's water type so it can learn surf. Giving it into Wingle, of course. And this guy is going to be called Wing Go. <laughs> oh, God, I'm funny as fuck. Uh, never mind. Okay, so what we need to do is get rid of... Uh, it's going to have to be Magic Magikarp for now, even though it could be useful eventually. Uh, bring in Wingull and just hope, hope that it can learn Surf. If not, that's about nearly 10 minutes of an episode absolutely wasted. He can't learn it, man! I'm going to have to grind this Magikarp up. Dude, I'm going to have to do like a sequence, a grinding montage with like Rocky-esque music in the background. Oh no. Well, mm, wait, let's just have a think about this for a second. What other Pokemon are there early on in this game that could learn Surf? Not Seedot. I'm pretty sure you can get Surskit somewhere. And I'm pretty sure you can get them in Route 2, where we are. And they're a water type, so maybe they can learn Surf. The water bug. Oh. Oh, this is painful. Pikachu should be able to learn Surf. I've seen him on a surfboard. Right, okay, okay, okay. Okay. It's gonna have to be... Uh, it's gonna have to be grinding that Magikarp up. Oh no, that's, that's so annoying though. Ugh, can I be asked to... Can I be asked to grind a Magikarp from 4 to 20? Oh, that's a long fucking way. Well, I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to. Let's do this. 
And uh, let's just put a cut there for grinding as well. Because I'm going to go away and I'm going to grind this up. And I'll be back in about three hours. Well, I've got the speed up button, so about ten minutes. It's not going to take me that long. It's going to be okay. I'm going to smash it. See you in a sec. Oh. Okay, we are making progress. We've got as far as level 18. So we're not doing too bad. We are, we're going to get there eventually. But it's going to be a ball eight. Thankfully, we at least we, at least he's learned tackle, so it's gonna make it a little bit better. Ugh. Come on, man. So far, I'm on about uh, maybe a quarter of an hour of doing this. Well, and it's at least gonna be another ten minutes because these last two levels are gonna be grindy as fuck. Um. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, fuck it. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna be right back again because I don't. I thought, oh, you know what? I'll do these levels on. I'll do the last two levels on camera. No, it's gonna take forever. Fuck that. I'm gonna finish it off right now. BRB. Okay, we are getting close. We are getting close. So, we can keep. I've come back onto the recording now. We're gonna do the last little bit of grinding here. I think I might run out of tackles again. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to just nip back and heal, but that's okay. It's only. Oh, actually, you know what? I might just get it before I run out of tackles. No, 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 no. Uh, actually, if I switch out now, I wonder if that'll be enough. Um, let's put Ty on that and just finish him off. Is that enough? Magic Hog gets level 20! Wee! Free Ty Hong gets 17 XP and... Oh, finally! Finally! We're going to get ourselves a Gyarados, get that thing evolved. It's only took about half an hour. <laughs> and then things are going to be looking good. We have got a Gyarados. We didn't get the choice to nickname the Magikarp when we got it. That's a shame. We'll have to wait till we get to her name later. And he learned something straight away. Was it Thrash? Because that makes him useful if it is. Bite. Very good. Right. And also, he's going to get Surf right now, which instantly makes him a lot more useful than the majority of Pokemon that I've got on my team, with Bite and Surf. That is a good start. So what we can do now is, back to what we were doing earlier, Exoplasm out front, switch train him, work out what the fuck he's all about, because I don't really understand him. And now is the time to Surf. Wait, 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 what did that say? Tis a liquid of some sort. Will you surf? Yes. When you say tis a liquid, uh, isn't it water? Now, I'm finding it a bit strange that we're not getting any counters right now. So let's take on this battle. Uh, CeeLo. Like CeeLo Green. Now, your ice type. Let's go in with Gyarados. <laughs> Because he is not a dragon, as a lot of people think he is. So, we can just keep biting him down. Yeah, there we go. Let's keep an eye out for things that have changed on this route, because obviously... Oh, Quillfish, interesting. Um, obviously, things are changing around here. And what I don't want to happen is to have something that can heal poison in you. What I don't want to happen is to go buy something um, obvious. Something good that could be knocking around that I might want to be involved in. There's a little island there, so let's take a look at that. Ah, I can't escape. One more try. There we are. And there's a guy here. Uh, yeah, he's a trainer. Ain't no money in being a sailor no more with the zombies and all. So I've become a pirate. Oh, there are pirates. That's good to know. Doesn't affect me out. Is me out dark type now as well? Damn it. Interesting. Uh, let's get Fat Eye on out there. Static comes off. And we can go in with the Thundershock. Dude, that slash is nasty. Payday. 
think we can finish it because we're faster. Yeah. Mouth should be dark type anyway, really. That's a good. That's a good. That's a good uh, decision to make him a dark type. I think. However, we've got a dark type friend as well, and his name is Pisacha. Dog versus cat. We all know who wins that one. Disable does nothing. Bite is not very effective because he's also a dark type. So maybe tackles better. Payday. Oh, neither are particularly useful, to be honest. Um, so, let's sand attack and try and drag this out a little bit. There we go. Right, now go for the tackles. And hopefully, it's not going to hit me. The leftovers are going to heal me back up, and I'm just going to kick this thing's ass. Yeah, easy. Good tactics there. And the pirate is down. Pretty poor pirate I am. You are, sir. Right, what... Is there anything on this island to pick up? Doesn't look like it, but there's another island there, so I'm quite interested to see that one as well. Uh, looks like there's nothing here either. Uh, anything down? Is that is that a gap there? Quillfish can fuck off. No, it's not. Okay. What I don't want to... Uh, I was going to say I don't want to battle the trainer that's down there, but he's a bit late now. Uh, now, you're part dark type as well, aren't you? Something tells me. I am a swimmer! Dimstufer! Ah, there we go. Look, items. Another broken heart. See, I don't know what they're for, but I'm going to keep collecting them, because... Seems like quite a specific item. Wingles can fuck off. I'm well annoyed at Wingles. They're bastards. I wasn't even on the screen. You weren't even on the screen. How can you see me? Ah, uh, you fit. It's okay. Well, Mer, uh, I think Revenant will be good against you. Oh, roll out though. I hate you. Okay, um... Let's buy this roll out. That'll be interesting. That's it. Next one's going to hit even harder. But that means that my roll out's going to hit... My bide's going to hit harder. Depending on how fat this guy is. Oh, he's too fat. Um... Okay, nature power's going to use surf, so that's not any good. I think maybe Gyarados is going to be the best choice here, just to survive this rollout. Hit it with the bite. There we go. Now what I really want to do is get to Doofood without dying too much. I see land there, so hopefully that means I'm close. Oh, I can't get away. Just run! RUN! Oh, there's an item there as well. Now, I think that looks like Doofood Cave. Or whatever it's called. Um. Ryzen. Resin. Let's see what the fuck that's for. A manly sweet. Raises attack of pokes. Okay. Uh, let's give that to Revenant then. Why not? Okay, so I can't do anything there. Oh, all there. But this is a good way to um, avoid the water. So. Stardust, that's some money. Not too bad, not too bad. We got here anything else? Right, I'm gonna avoid the cave for a um, for the minute because I want to see if there's a trainer tips. Press the A button if you get by it. Yeah. What I what I actually want to do is um, visit the Pokemon Center before I do anything else. There's a gym here as well, so that's gonna be gym badge number three, I guess. I surfed here on my Gyarados, all the way from Sutopolis. I'm exhausted, but at least I'm safe. Yeah, that's a long way to go, my friend. How about you, sweetie? When Groudon Sunlight got stuck in Granite Cave, they renamed it Solar Caverns. It's so we don't forget the power of that horrible monster. Make sure never to awaken it again. I have a feeling I might. Welcome to Pokemon Center. Yes. There we go. The leader here used to be a guy called Brawly. He used the fighting type, but since he got promoted to the... Oh... Kahuto Elite Four. 
Is that a reason I'm not aware of? Kahuto Elite 4. We've got a new girl. She's way stronger than Brawly ever was. Oh, good. Do for town. A tiny island in a blue sea. We're so lucky not to have been touched by the zombie plague. Those who surfed over or swum over have here have told us terrible stories of life on the mainland. You best hope that somebody doesn't bring the plague with them. That's my son train on the beach. Did you know that before he learned to arm thrust, he learned how to ice punch? No, he made it into a TM. I want you to have it. Good. My son's trained for years at a time to learn techniques of battle, and my husband puts him in TMs and gives him to trainers to improve their skills. Very good. So what does he give me there? Arm thrust or ice punch? Ice punch. Freezing punch that can leave the foe frozen solid. Uh, ooh. That'd be interesting for Fight On to have. Uh, yeah. That's some good random coverage there. No one expects a Pikachu with an ice punch. It is a liquid of some sort. Now, I don't want to sail yet because I'm not done on this town. I'm just checking items, seeing if there's anything nearby. Uh, have I been in this one yet? No. TV station no longer broadcasting. Yeah. You're right, everyone got eaten. This plus band. It was a gift from my girlfriend, Laura. She worked in Norman's gym. Oh, I met her! She's probably dead now. I don't want it anymore. Obtain the plus band. No, she's alive. I've seen her. Raises the power of normal type moves. Okay. She's fine, honestly. Right, so what do we do first? First of all, do you think this guy will give us a fishing rod? Yeah! So fishing rod. That's cool. I earn a bonus, I'll even throw in a little fishing advice. Thanks, I know how to fish. Thanks, thanks. So, this guy... I feel like he's going to give us arm thrust when we beat him. That's why him and his dad have uh, both been talking to us about it. So, let's find out whether we're right about that or not. I love that this Gyarados has still got Splash. Yep. Eggplasm gets level 10. Next, another Makuhita, and then I bet it's got a Hariyama afterwards. Ah, no. Hit one top. Interesting. Again, another surf, I think, is going to be... Ooh, triple kick. Good move. A bit scary, but... Pursuit, I'm not going anywhere, so I'm holding on with that. Oh, it tricks me with the quick attack, though. Makes me feel safe and then destroys me. Uh, so let's go in for Revenant. Ooh, and then, yeah, let's not, then. How about Marley? Flipping heck. Revenant's not messing around. Self-destruct. Uh, yes. That could be useful. I don't know. Nah. There we go. No, my arm thrust is still not strong enough, it seems. Sorry about that. I'm still training. One day I'll be able to use arm thrust with as much power as my Makuhita. Yeah, boy. You keep training and you will get there. That's what it's all about, sunshine. Move! Move! Okay. So, let's go and have a look in... So what, what, what were they calling it? Oh, shit. Solar caverns, I think? Whoa! A vast and alien roar echoes out of the cave. Whatever's in there, I don't want to enter. Okay, so I guess Groudon's in there, maybe. I didn't really get what the roar was, but... That sounds okay. Well, let's go take on the gym. What more is there to do in this town? I can't get Flash because I can't get inside there. I'm the advisor. I'm no trainer, not me, but I can sure give you winning advice. So listen. Haruko uses the Dark type. It's a fragile type that won't take a fighting move, but can deal out massive damage with the rapacious talons and big teeth. Okay. Well, I've got... I've got Marley here who's a psychic type, so he's no good. Gyarados will be okay against that. Fight Taihong will be okay. Revenant um, and Pisacha also... Should be alright. It's only really Marley that's useless. Although it has got Rock Tomb and stuff, so... There are options there. Now. Has this gym changed in its layout? Uh, there's a trainer there. I feel like that was the right way, though. So I kind of want to keep going that way. And that's the crate. Ah, oh, hang on. It's dark in here. The dark is good for our dark types. Oh, I see. 
Uh, so let's go. <laughs> let's get away from there. For starters. Going with Fire Tai Hong. Goes for Taunt. Not interested. So we'll hit the. Can't use Thunder Wave after the Taunt. What can I use? Oh, you can only use attacking moves. That's right. Yeah. So what's the best thing to use against this? Is it part ice itself anyway? Yeah. Nah. Uh, probably Thundershot then. But nothing's really doing that much damage. However, I am getting good grindiness. So it's not too bad. There we go. Yeah. Ice and film student Kangamoto goes down. Well, maybe this is the right way because this seems to be like lining up here. There is another pirate. Why do they all have me out there? Eh? So let's get Pishacha out there. He's not going to be affected too badly by Meowth's new dark typing. And we'll go for the same thing that we did against that Persian. We'll do three sand attacks. And then uh, I think just tackle because bite's probably not going to be very effective. And we've got leftovers to keep healing us back up. So yeah, we can afford to grind that one out. Matteo goes down. Now let's see where we end up. Yeah, this the layout of this gym has changed. Uh... Oh, which way is that coming from? I've just heard this new song from the Visbu region. Wow. So we have new regions popping up all over the place here. Uh, Shinx. Revenant will be good for Shinx. Gets paralyzed though. Uh, nature power should be swift. Yeah. One more of those. Ah, he's... Revive? He's dead. I mean, it's alive. Can't use revive on it. Using Shinx again, so we'll stick. Keep going for that nature power. So I think we can beat it. Yeah, there we go. And then it's got Luxio, which I think Pishata might be a good choice here. Luxio's part dark, I'm pretty sure. So we can. Let's go for the sand attacks again. Three of those to lower it. Oh, I went for four of those then. Went one extra. And then tackles. Grind that out. Yeah, there we go. Why don't you want to hear it? Because it's shit. Right, are we there? Hey, we found the leader. Right. Let's take a look at our bag. See if we can afford to just... Oh, I've got shitloads of them. I think we can afford, because we've got a few zombie livers, a few super potions. I think we can just keep on going. Uh, and take on this gym leader. Now, I'm not going to start with Ectoplasm out. No, I am. I am going to. Get him the experience. Fuck it. Right, okay. Here we go. Two gym badges in one episode. Could come right here. Ah, you must be a ghost. My trainers have been warning me you're strong. Unfortunately, I can't battle you. I need you to do a favour for me. You see, there have been rumours lately that there's something nasty at the bottom of Solar Caverns. I'd like to investigate. When you come back, I'll fight you. Well, here we go, then. I guess we're not taking on the gym leader, so let's go to... S oh, all that, wasting all them healing items for nothing. Okay, so let's go heal up. Um, find our way out of here. Here we go. Go to Solar Caverns and see what it looks like, because it's different to... Um, wait, is there a mark? No. It's different to... If it's different to the original cave that was here, if it's a different layout, um, then it's a bit of a ball ache. If not, it's actually not very long. So I might be able to get down to the bottom. I barely made it out of there alive. There's something down there, there's something real nasty. I don't even want to think about it. Well, I'm going to go and fight it. There it was again. Whatever it is, I'm getting closer. Shit. Well, the layout's different already. I can see that. The question is, is it bigger? Is it longer? Is it going to take a long time to get through? That orb thrust is not the best. And it's not dark like it usually is down here. That raw, there it is again. It seems somehow familiar. All right, so it's something that I've met before then. Um, 
while we're... Yeah, let's try and catch this Maku here. Uh, because... It would be quite good. If we can evolve it, it's a bit of a tank, so that'd be quite nice. Um, however, I don't seem to be hitting it, really. Oh, perfect! Uh, let's get some balls out there. Great ball, yeah. Yes! There we fucking go! Just make a note of that as well. Makahita is tenacious. It will keep getting up and attacking its foe however many times it's been knocked down. Every time it gets back up, this Pokemon stores more energy in its body for evolving. Ah. Give a nickname to Makuhita. Yes! And uh, Makuhita... Oh, I've not got my uh, spooky names up. We're going to call him... Maku Horror. Makuhara. Still, still sounds quite Japanese, that Makuhara. Nose pass. I hate nose pass for the passion. Right. While we're getting through this cave, I'm going to put somebody else out front because I. That's taking too long to get away. So, Sundance Rock. Ah, so I need a bike to get up there so I can come back when I've got a bike. Um. And that's good. So there's an item here. Pokeball. Cool. Uh, some ladders over there. Let's check out what is south of here, though. Nothing. Abra! Uh, okay, it's going to just teleport away, so let's just throw a Pokeball. See if it stays in. Ah. Oh. Damn it! Well, now I know there's Abra's in here, I'm definitely going to come back and try and find one of them. I'd like an Alakazam on the team, for sure. Right, uh, so let's try and... F there we go. I need something fast with a... Um... Do I have, like, a sleeping move? I've got Grass Whistle. I've got the TM for Grass Whistle. So maybe I'll teach someone Grass Whistle. Ah, oh, I thought I had it then. Uh, and then I can just put it to sleep. Uh, oh, ectoplasm. That's useful. Oh, however, I don't think it's going to be faster than a um, Abra, however. So maybe that wasn't the best move. I definitely heard it before, but where? Wah! Why are these new flashbacks so painful? Ah, more flashbacks. Grrr, contract is terminated! What, what was that? That voice, it's like nothing on Earth. Oh, shit. Aliens, man. So, we've gone deeper into solar caverns. Let's keep it moving. And hope that we're going to come up against something that we are not going to get destroyed by. There's a rock there. That looks ominous. Oh, I hear noise. What is that? Well... A memory, but of what? I saw something flash up then, but I didn't quite catch what it was. Well, let's have a look at this rock. Neverstone. Is that the same as Neverstone? By any chance, but renamed badly. Prevents, yeah. Prevents evolution. Rock pass at level... Kind of tempting to try and catch that at that level. Yeah. We have got Nose Pass. Give it an captured Nose Pass. Yes. Oh, I'm going to have to find a scary, spooky nickname for Nose Pass now, aren't I? Let's uh, have a quick look at what we can find. Or we'll just find a good Nose Pass nickname because... Uh, name rater... Uh, on the name rate on pkmn.net is pretty good. Gives people all the nick gives you all the nicknames that people call these things. Uh, name rater, call it name rater. Influenza. 
Nasal North, Comp Nose, Lava Snot, Baldy Mag. He's a bald magnet. Is he? Is he a magnet? I don't think he is. He has a big nose and always faces north, so we call him Nasal North. I quite like Influenza. I like I like the diseasey sort of um, connotation that that brings. So we're gonna go for Influenza. Perfect. And we keep moving. There's more ladders here, so they're gonna take us up. Uh, oh, let's go up again. Okay, not running into anything for. Oh, not again! Ah, more flashbacks. That kind of looks like a Charizard, like a shiny Charizard. I guess the only way to find out is to continue. Yeah. Okay. There's a door there. Oh shit. Solar caverns. That's odd, there doesn't seem to be anyone here. I can hear noises though. Ooh. You! What, what, what is this? Dude, that definitely looks like a Charizard. Meteor. Our contract is terminated, human. We have joined the horseman now. I remember you now, your meteor, the Dragon King. Ah! Dragon says what now as well. Yes, I am Meteor. I thought Pestilence had arranged for your death. Apparently so she did. I suppose I'll have to finish the job that she could not complete. Do you really have to preface every sentence with a roar? It's really startling. <laughs> Silence! I will eradicate you. Let's do it. So are we actually battling this thing or is this thing going to send out Pokemon for us to battle? Dragon King Meteor would like to battle. Dude, that's just a shiny Charizard. Sends out Dragon. Oh my days. The dragon is sending out a dragon. Okay, well, that's good because I'm guessing dragon's dragon type and uh, Fight Eye Hong's got Ice Punch. Dragon knows Dig. Interesting. Uh, so... Oh, what the fuck? Okay, that's that plan out the window. Pishata is going to have to come out. Now, nah, don't go for Dig again. Fire Pump! What the fuck is that move? Right, we swap out for Gyarados. Gyarados is flying tight. Dig's not going to hit. Okay. So that's a good start. I feel like this thing might be fire tight. Because it used a fire move. But it's not. Uh, let's just try bite this time. Dragon breath. Right, Gyarados was definitely the right guy to go out to. But... I think one more move. Yeah. We're going to have to um, use an item here. Use the super potion as well. That's okay. We can keep on uh, keep on keeping on. So let's use the attack plus uh, and then go in with wait. I oh, don't know. Bite's probably a special as well. Is Dark special in this? Bites obviously should be a physical move. Ah, uh, now Burn as well. Right, that's fucked me over. The fact that this thing's got a Fire-type move means that Revenant's going to get destroyed as well. However... Oh, that Bide might come in useful. No! Why didn't it release energy earlier than that? I'm confused. Um... Right, it's faster than me, which is useful in this situation. Shit a brick. Man, this thing is not giving me a good time. Right, uh I'm gonna have to heal up somebody here. Uh probably Marley is gonna be the best bet. Oh, I'm not sure about that, but. Right, it's got levitate, so I can't hit with a rock move or a ground move. So, side beam's the only thing I can do. And it gets the confusion. That could be useful. Heal Marley back up. Hope it hits itself. It does. Right, we go back for another side beam. Hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Dragon breath. We can live that. Oh.
Lots of healing having to happen here. Dragon's confused. Hit yourself. There we go. We can hit it. I think a side beam might finish it. Snaps out of confusion. Oh no. Flies up. I'm a ground type though. Which means it's going to be super effective. Shit. Oh no. Normal. Okay. Side beam hits. Oh. Come on. Dragon breath. I survived that. Hit with a side beam. Down goes Dragon. Now, I didn't see if he had another Pokemon after. If he has, then this battle's already over. Get in. Dragon King Meteor is toast. Impossible! Can it be you did not lose all your power? <laughs> Must be shiny got Charizard. We will meet again, mark my words. I may not be able to destroy this town right now, but I'll be back soon enough. Phew, what was that about? What power is it that I lost? Oh, this is all so confusing. I better tell that bitch about this. Well, it looks like we are going back to do for town. So, we can wrap this episode up here. Get this item. Fuck. <laughs> uh, well, maybe we'll quickly run around while I say my farewells and just pick up, what that, pick up that item uh, as the last thing that we do. Hombone? Wait a second. That's a new Pokemon. And I killed it. Yeah, let's go see what this item is. And then we'll wrap up. Because uh, I hate to leave it like that when I'm just about to pick something up. I need to know what that is. Could be something amazing. So, yep. Yeah, as soon as we get that item then, we will head back to Doofer Town. Take, go back to the gym leader. I'm guessing then she's going to let us fight her. Because that seemed to be the deal that she's made. Um, and then, hopefully, get our next gym badge. Let's see what this is. It's a TM. That's good because we can have a look what that is. Sunny day. Nah, it could be useful if I get a fire type mon. No, I don't need to go down there. What I need to do is go back here. Get back to the Pokemon Center. And that is all that she wrote for this episode. So, all that, left, all that is left is for me to say thank you very much for popping in and watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, make sure you leave a like. Make sure you subscribe. Uh, and this will drop into your box every single time that it's posted i'm posting these on wednesdays and sundays so the next one's gonna be a sunday no this is a sunday the next one's gonna be a wednesday uh, so look out for that and we will take on the gym leader and get badge number three we're only in do for time we're already gonna have badge number three hopefully all going well thank you all for watching and i'll see you all on wednesday for part five see you later